Hey guys, welcome back. DeFi, DGN Strip, and Farm for Poverty. I'm your host, Drip Coach, dropping knowledge bombs on all Forex Shark related projects. And in today's video, we're going to get into the updates that were kicked out in the Forex Shark Calls channel and uh, just take a look at what they've done with the marketing so far. There's been a big push, so I'm going to try to cover all that uh, in a short video so you guys can see what's been going on and, of course, support. Uh, the various locations like Twitter or TikTok, you know, sharing, liking, all that good stuff. So let's start first uh, right in the Telegram channel. So there is a big TikTok promo just went live with 1.3 million subscribers. More big promo dropping soon. Prepare and support. We'll be announcing two AMAs and interviews scheduled for this week shortly. So I think he means, I don't know, this week as in today. Um... Maybe he's going to be announcing them, but the uh, I would imagine that they might be going on next week. I don't know. But anyway, that's awesome. So we've been waiting on some AMAs, so we'll see where that goes. And this is a really cool video I saw. It's on uh, TikTok. I'm going to play this for you because it's only 48 seconds. Only decentralized ownership, lending, and yield aggregating protocol in DeFi with unique characteristics such as fully decentralized lending, dynamic supply control, variable tax rewarding loyalty to eliminate sell pressure, and community ownership governance model with voting, profit share, and crowdfunding. The official AFP governance token is now open as a pre sale opportunity to those who want to have ownership of what will be the highest performing yield generating project in the world for years to come. As an added bonus, they are running a promotion leading up to the official October 18th launch, whereby users stand a chance to win $5,000. Visit the website animalfarm.app to enter now. The Animal Farm is the only. All right. So um, I think that's really well done. I'm not on TikTok and I'm, I'm sure the bulk of the audience on TikTok is a uh, kind of younger generation, but this is a more professional video done on TikTok. So, um, yeah, I don't know what's going to come from this, but it's pretty cool to see and seeing some love in the comments already. So people supporting it, which can help it get more visibility. So, yeah, shouts out to that. I think that's awesome. Good first step for sure. Then there's a massive Twitter campaign push. So if you are on Twitter, go through here. Well, first for Twitter, we got the Bitcoin.com uh, article, which is here. Um, it was on the homepage. Well, it's still on the homepage, but it's no longer front and center because by the time I'm making this video, it's been 22 hours. So it's down here now, 22 hours later since this was actually uh, released. It was up here um in the featured section but i think they only keep that there for like a couple hours and whoever's up next but the article is really well written again and bitcoin.com gets a lot of um authentic traffic it's the easiest one of the easiest websites to find and get information on like crypto so this is a really well done article so i think that's good that's going to definitely bring some organic traffic and questions to uh maybe these various uh, websites like our the actual app itself or Twitter, Discord, YouTube. So, you know, be on the lookout for people joining in there. And then they're, like I said, a big Twitter push. So definitely come through here and actually go through each of these and like and comment. It doesn't take that long. Remember, it does pump your own bag. So you just click the link. I haven't gone through this yet. So I'm just going to show you real quick on this one how easy it can be done. And, um, it's again, it pumps your own bag, supports the project and keeps the uh, Twitter algorithm or engagement feed kind of um, keeps us relevant. And it normally isn't this low, but when I'm recording a video, it does take a little longer. But all you got to do is hit the like button. And these are basically just kind of copy paste. So I think Forex gave them a script and all these people did is just paste this in and say, you know, do this, follow, blah, 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 blah. But you can see we have 487 likes, 326 week tweets. So I'm going to go ahead and like it as well. And then do a retweet. Real simple. There you go. So do that for all of the uh, posts. You know, put your brick in, as Bart of Town would say. So I think that that will um, definitely help because they push this out since so a lot of people so can definitely can end up being trending on YouTube. Uh, I'm sorry, on Twitter. And it will show up in the search over here. So 
do your part for that. So it's good to know that we're moving forward. And uh, also one other thing, there is an updated video on the Animal Farm homepage. So Forex mentioned in the previous AMA, I forgot when it was, but that he wanted to redo the video and he did do that. So now it's like 12 minutes to the five, but it has some more detailed in infographics and stuff to cover some of the more complex topics that he was uh, discussing. And I think it's a little more engaging, looks better, looks cleaner kind of things. And I think there might've even been additional questions that were asked. I listened to it, but I don't remember being able to compare it to the original one. But the point is it's been done uh, a lot better looking. Uh, we got 56,000 entries already in here. So that's awesome as well. Just a quick message, please like, subscribe, and turn on notifications so you don't miss another video. This helps bring brand awareness to the channel as well as all Forex Shark related projects. Thank you. And what else I got? I think that's it. So that's the updates for this video. Oh, let's take a look at the pig's token price. So we have come up a little bit from that sell off that we had. And yeah, it's hard to say if this is coming from marketing or not, but uh, definitely you can see that this is a different style of marketing than we've had ever before. The most common and the average that we had previously was just AMAs for people in the community. Now you've got external TikTokers with influence. You've got Telegram, I'm sorry, Twitter influencers. He says he's got two more AMAs um, coming. And he did mention there were some big YouTubers that he scheduled. I saw a YouTube uh, video already. Um, a guy from a, with another with an accent from a different country. So it's definitely reaching a different audience. Um, we won't know how this really affects the price until you know we launch. Some people will still wait to buy the hype and they don't want to buy the value because maybe they don't understand it yet. And then also there is still a barrier to entry. So depending on how familiar you are with DeFi and crypto, you may not understand what to do when you get here. So it's definitely doing um, a lot in regards to brand awareness. And that's the main thing, getting our name out there, seeing that um, uh, icon, the website and all that stuff like that, regardless of what people buy, because they can be retargeted later. If the uh, marketing uh, CMO is doing anything with this, they have maybe an email campaign or they do retargeted um, YouTube ads or something like that, where if they saw one ad, they can then send them another ad that gets this uh, more, uh, what would you call it, more friendly towards walking them down the sales funnel and help them to make uh, the steps necessary to purchase the token. So um, either way, uh, this is definitely awesome to see and glad to see that this is rolling out. We're still kind of holding the line with Trip. We're sitting at around $6 and some change. Let's pull that up real quick. So sitting in the 677 range. So we're still holding that. I made a video about this. So it'll be coming out later talking about this is basically the reservoir propping us up here. That's why we keep seeing this stable price floor, so to speak. And um, that is a good thing. So we're still just trading sideways there. And we've had a little bit of reduction in the TVL. I think this primarily came from, um, uh, well, actually, no, I don't know. I think the TVL is only capturing pigs, piggy bank and pig pen, but I know we've seen a reduction in the garden. So I thought that the TVL reduction would have been from the garden, but I guess it was just from people taking profits on the, um, on the pigs. So let's take a look at the garden. This is my small garden, but I just want to see the contract balance. I think that's gone down to just above 500,000. Yeah. So we're almost breaking that 500,000. So we have like 514 at some stage. And that's due simply like I put in the other video, people are taking these and pairing them and put or keeping them in their wallet waiting for the farm to launch. So don't be surprised if this drops down lower. There's no cause for alarm. That's exactly what's supposed to happen as we get closer to the launch. And then that's going to make it more attractive for new people once the farms are uh, launched to get in and decide to build their position in the garden as well. So it actually makes room for new people to get sizable positions because the existing whales with the big uh, plants sizes will be claiming, which will be reducing their... Um, total production. And then that allows for other people to outpace them. So me personally, I'm not taking any LPs and stacking them right now. I'm just going to wait till day one. I don't, I don't see the point. 
because the pigs, I think minting on the uh, drip BUSD farm is always going to be a really high yield. I'm not really worried about that. So I'm not stacking mine just yet. That's just my personal strategy. I think this is going to always be a decent payout. And we got plenty of time with the initial launch to where even if you don't have a big position here on day one, like within the first one to two months, you still have time to build it. So that's my strategy anyway. All right, that is it for this video. Hope you found it valuable and please definitely not only like, subscribe, but go out here and like and retweet and all that. And if you're on TikTok, uh, do that as well. Until next time, guys, lift daily and achieve your impossible. See ya.